Smash or pass, which I've just been told by my uh, Gen Z producer page, is like fuck, Mary kill, but for young people. Because they don't have the time to figure out who they're going to kill. Kill. They just or, who, or marry. They just yeah. want to smash or smash pass. pass. Yeah, I like it. I like it. Yeah, 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 yeah. So yeah. Um, two choices. You know, it's a younger generation. They have a shorter attention span. They can only categorize two things. Absolutely, I like it. And you sure. And um, and so a few things to know. So here we have J.B. Pritzker, governor of Illinois, Democrat, mm -hmm. uh, since 2018, signed the Reproductive Health Care Act. Uh, which codifies Roe v. Wade into law in yep. 2019, legalize weed, yeah. raise the minimum wage to $15 an hour, ban private immigration detention centers, mm -hmm. and forbade state and local police to cooperate with ICE. But he is a billionaire. He is. I know. Although socialists love him. Apparently, Socialist for Pritzker has 10,000 followers on Twitter, guys. It's pretty good. Um oh. I'm a big fan. I'll tell you, I'm a big fan. First of all, um, I like him because he's thick with two C's. Um, <laughs> he's like the first thick uh, politician that I'd ever, you know, like king that I've ever felt like. I don't know. It's been years since I've been like, it looks good on. It looks good on him. I mean, yeah. he just like he's got uh, those. He's got a, a nice, powerful gaze, but kind eyes. Uh, you know. Why do they all look like characters from Batman? Why does every governor look like a Batman character? Well, like specifically like, like, Chicago, Chicago politicians. Right, like JB looks like a bat with the, the he's got an orange tie on in this photo. Yeah, yeah. Like Gavin Newsom is Batman. <laughs> you know, like DeSantis <laughs> is such a villain. Yeah. And like anyway, okay, so smash or pass on Pritzker? I, I'm saying smash. I'm going with okay. smash. Lori, smash or pass on Pritzker. Oh, yeah. I love a thick man. Like, um, you know, I love a thick man in a, in a nice suit. Yeah. Um, I feel like I could convince him to give up some of his money. I am a fairly skilled former sex worker. And so <laughs> I feel like I also have this idea for like a new show. So it'd be like hoarders, but for like billionaires. So we would come in like as a team of socialists and help them <laughs> unhoard their money. Oh, yeah. So I feel like I, he would be a good candidate. Yeah, so it. like we would go in and help like liberals and, and left leaning people unhoard their fucking money. Yeah. Right? So I feel like I could maybe like pitch that to him and it would be a good look for him. Like maybe knock you down to a millionaire status. You yeah. don't have to have so much shit, JB. Yeah. It's cool. It'll be great. You and me, thick and thick. It'll be great. We're like, <laughs> it's about damn time. We can do it on TikTok with some Lizzo music. It'll be great. I'll, <laughs> I'll smash. I'll smash. I'm, yeah, I don't know him. And so I like the mystery. So I'm going to say smash. Yeah. Uh, that's attractive to me politically. I don't know about sexually. I don't know if I would, uh, how I would He's do He's got it. a Tony Soprano vibe. Under I think or be over there. It. I, uh, no. No, what I mean by that he is does. like, like, you know, like it looks, it, he looks Good. You just yeah. haven't seen him speak yet. No, it's true. It's true. It's true. I need to see. Um, I need to see some some clips to yeah. just sort of like you know get it up for him. But uh, <laughs> <laughs> all right. Second over here, another Democrat, Gavin Newsom, Democrat from California, won his recall. Uh, campaigned on Medicare for all, but will not lift a fucking finger for Medicare for all ever. Uh, pushed the largest economic stimulus ever, a hundred billion dollars. In fact, right now Californians are all getting an inflation check. Essentially, um, he became the first state, or, or and we became the first state to have universal free school breakfast and lunch, and also recently just pardoned a woman who was um, serving time for killing her trafficker uh, when she was 16. And she did serve a lot of time, way too much time, but Newsom just pardoned her. So there's good, there's bad, there's... Charlie uh, Gilfile? There's, I can't, I don't That's know. the thing. That's why it's an uh, immediate pass. Immediate pass. Because he's he's damaged goods. I, I'm sorry. He's I, he is, I and I hate to do that like... <laughs> Guilt by association thing, you know, who you date in your past is who you date M often. I'm very, like, forgiving and uh, understanding. We've all made mistakes, but Kimberly fucking Guilfoyle? Yeah. How... He helped create that monster. Yeah, yeah. That's on That's on him. I'm sorry. So I, it's a hard pass on, on Gavin Newsom. Um, also, 
uh, how are you going to be named Gavin and be Gavin. the yeah and be the governor of California and not have like a voice that fucking sounds like this? Like the fact that he has it like sounds- a Batman voice. Like, <laughs> <laughs> it's like no, no he's got to no. be more. He's got to be like, hey, what's up? How he's you doing, gone. this is Gavin? Uh, everyone gets free White Claw and fuck yeah, dude. Like, <laughs> I could do Lori one. Smasher Pass. Yeah, it's a hard pass for me because I can never forgive him for that picture of him and Kimberly Gilfile in front of that goddamn uh, fireplace yeah. on like the on like the <laughs> animal rug. rug. Oh. It's ridiculous. Oh. Um, Sir, never nope. passing. I, you know, I gotta be honest with you. This is I'm gonna just have an honest fucking moment. I say smash both physically as well as politically. Given the shit that we're in now, mm. I don't fair. think Newsom is liter. I don't think he's the worst option. And at the end of the fair. night, on a you know a couple drinks deep, definitely not I, the worst true. option. I don't like so, hearing this. And I'm sure he could take me all. to French Laundry. Never been there. No I one's could ever take you to French Laundry. French I could laundry take before. you to French Laundry. Now, I don't, in I, fairness, I, if I was tipsy, mm-hmm. he could get it. Yeah. I mean, but, I get. I mean, that's only because I like a cocky white boy when I'm drunk. <laughs> <laughs> so funny. I mean, look, beggars can't be choosers. I think we smash <laughs> Gavin Newsom. Over beggars here. can't be. Cho- you're not a. You're. You're our neither a beggar nor a chooser. We our democracy is in a state. That's true, but uh, of begging and not choosing. At this point, I'm choosing and begging at the same time. I don't give a shit. Um, let Let's move on to Mr. Ron DeSantis. Gross. Oh <laughs> my god. I mean, <laughs> obviously. The smash. I don't think this dude's had consensual sex ever. <laughs> um, and uh, yeah, he looks like a f- like ten frat houses formed together to, yeah. to become the ultimate frat. Yes, yeah, yeah. He does have like the you know what is it? Uh, he's like a Voltron of uh, frat fuckboys. Yeah, but God, anyway, yes. he, we we don't need to go over his uh, his laundry list of awful things he's done. But obviously. Um, you know, uh, uh, let's see. Uh, I'm like, uh, he's friends with S- Sebastian Gorka, Milo Yiannopoulos, mm-hmm. and Steve uh-huh. Bannon. Uh-huh. He uh, enacted a 15 week abortion ban, mm-hmm. and it, which is being challenged currently. Um, he the don't say gay bill. The don't say him just letting COVID run rampant through his state, and you know, lying it, about the numbers. Lying about the numbers. Him basically. Uh, forcing everyone to do quote herd immunity, which just meant more dead people. Uh, him denying science just so that he could uh, fucking suck up to Trump. Yep. Just sacrificing, just doing human sacrifice all day, every day. So that's hot for you. Yeah, that like I'm not gonna lie. It's like anyone who's willing to kill their own people just so that they can <laughs> get power. What's not to love? You know I mean? Smash or pass? That was just hard pass. <laughs> hard pass. <laughs> fuck them. Fuck them. And but not fuck them. But don't fuck them. Yeah. Lori. Yeah, hard pass for me, but I would consider a smash ish mm. if he employed me to flog him. Like oh, if he employed yes. me the dominatrix. Yes. I would beat the shit out of him. <laughs> <laughs> like I would beat the shit out of him. Like you ever see the Players Club when she's beating those cops and making them say I'm black and I'm proud? Like that type of shit. Like just say gay, say gay. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, Amazing. Yes. I can't top that, but I am going to pass and uh, leave Lori with that amazing, amazing image. image. <laughs> Forcing him to say oh, gay. God. <laughs> Christy Gnome is. What? I'm sorry. Is, <laughs> like, is an objective snack. Like, she's gorgeous. She's got, like, I, I don't know. I, I don't. I actually, to be honest with you, she's not my type. Mm. Um, but I see that she is objectively pretty, I guess, in the Barbie sense of the word. Yeah. Um, definitely not my type politically. Um, she basically developed legislation in the wake of the Keystone XL pipeline protests that could, that, uh, was like anti-protest legislation Mm -hmm. that allowed the state to sue protesters. Um, she fought the ACLU for years on it. She got rid of the concealed carry um, permit uh, requirement. 
hates gay marriage, hates gay people, hates masks, and hates um, anyone who doesn't call rape a blessing. Mm -hmm. I, I don't I don't think she deserves me. I think I could do at better all. at all. You can do so much better. You yeah, do so much I'm, a, better. I'm a pass, but Matt, um, you're trash. So I'm trash. Ah! Uh, I'm going to say smash and I'll tell you why <laughs> it's not, it doesn't have anything to do with looks. What it has to do with is that I could imagine it being very easy to be in a relationship with her because as someone who has literally had, has no imagination, uh, <laughs> it, like the fact that she couldn't even imagine a scenario in which banning, uh, abortion altogether would include a 10 year old girl. Right, right. The fact is, is that she would think I'm some sort of like sorcerer with my imagination <laughs> is alone. Is that because you're a Jew? Uh, well, she definitely, be like, because I'm a Jew, wow. she would think I'm a sorcerer. Just that <laughs> on that alone, she'd be like, oh. all wizards? <laughs> yeah, yeah. Oh, yeah. yeah. Oh, wow. I heard, heard y'all was magic. Um, <laughs> but Not I like just, Negroes, but also yeah, magic. Yeah, yeah. But like a, a more sinister magic as opposed to <laughs> Negroes, who's a beautiful, like, uh, Happy magic. A bagger Vance type magic. You're more happy uh, magic. Yeah. <laughs> uh, but yeah, um, I feel like her lack of imagination would make her think that I'm a genius. And it would just be nice, you know, for someone to be like. I think some... you're a genius. I mean, genius. See, uh, immediately. She wouldn't put it in air quotes. She would just be like, <laughs> wow. be like Matt is a genius. Matt is a genius. Lori, Chrissy Gnome. <sighs> so um, I'm not sure why all Republican, like, politicians that are women are styled like milf porn stars <laughs> yes, yes. like i know i'm gonna get entire entire like i'm gonna get in trouble for saying this but it's fucking true yes. <laughs> like i don't understand it and that's not attractive for me personally mm -hmm. it's not i'm not really into like hot suburban mom look like no. you know mm -hmm. like i i consider myself to be a gilf but that's not my personal style <laughs> so um i'm gonna pass because i i like you know i like my hotties to look more like ndre than um than like desperate housewives no yeah. yes exactly and also to have way better politics like you oh know. yeah absolutely although i feel like some desperate somehow the housewives are kind of cool right i don't watch it but I know some of them are. Are they all bad? I've never seen it, but some people really never like that. It. The, the, the... <laughs> it's the aesthetic. That, it's the, it's the aesthetic that's a no for me. Yeah, yeah, yeah a lot aesthetic. of them are very attractive. It's the styling. Yeah, that's it's, a no for me. Like I'm both jealous of their cut arms, and I'm also like that makes you inhuman. Like that <laughs> that having that <laughs> much normal. cut. Yeah, but it's the like, cut arms, but it's also the cut faces. Like they all go to the same plastic surgery. Well, everything's dead. Nothing moves up yeah, there. Yeah, so yeah, yeah. That's yeah. number one. Yeah. But anyway. And do you? I mean, I'm happy if you're happy. Totally. Hey, if you're I'm not happy if you're like coerced into that, which yeah. you know, a lot of us are. Yep. 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 Uh, yep, yep. In, indeed. Um, anywho, um, fuck Clarence Thomas. And uh, uh, yes. And I was up mentioned to the sentient Tom that. Um, thumb that runs my state because hard pass on him. Oh, yeah. We have another. We have Tate Reeves up here. <laughs> Woo! Yes, see what I mean? Like, Jesus. he can't even get a new barber. He's had that same haircut. You can look up his pictures from when he went to college. He's had that same doofy smile. He haircut. really does look like a thumb. Oh, my God. <laughs> Paige he, created this. Tell me I'm lying. He looks like a sentient fucking thumb. He looks like Bill Gates with a thyroid problem. <laughs> I've literally said, I've literally tweeted about it before. I'm like, shut the fuck up, you sentient thumb. <laughs> like, oh his name Amazing. is actually Johnny, Jonathan Tate Reeves the third, Because, Jeez. of course, to be this obnoxious of a fuck, yeah. you have to be the third of yeah, something. Yeah, yeah. That is that is the most third in, times a charm inbred looking ass dude I've seen in a long time. <laughs> I mean, uh, like definitely a definitely a member of like the Confederate something somethings of Mississippi. Yeah, which oh yeah, he's always oh yeah. at that kind of shit. So, mm -hmm. oh my God. what's going on, Fran Tifa? If you haven't already. Subscribe to this channel right now. Hit that button. And also, you can become a patron and support the show every single week. Get access to bonus episodes and exclusive merchandise. Patreon.com slash Bituation Room. Do it.